John here, guys! And today we're talking about the URUAV Lion Pack. This is a long range pack built up of four 18650s in there. It is 3,000 milliamps for you to be able to fly the maximum amount of range, the maximum amount of flight time. Um, and you know what, though, guys? Uh, yes, okay. This is the longest battery I've flown. I flew it on the on the Flywheel Explorer. It's the longest battery pack I've flown in FPV ever, period. But it's not as long as some other people were getting. Um, maybe they're using more premium cells in their homemades. Maybe they can cruise um, slower than I can cruise. I don't know. I'm like, I wasn't doing any power loops or anything. I was just cruising. I got 15 minutes, okay? Now, I did have to take five minutes to bind this up because I forgot that this was bound up to a different radio. So I did have the battery on for a few minutes, but it wasn't flying. So I don't think that really took too much of the uh, flight time off of it. 15 minutes is super long, but it's not the 30, 40 minutes that some people were getting. So maybe there are some premium packs out there. This one is a slightly cheaper variety. I put the price on the screen right there. But you know what I would personally do? I would fly one of my favorite classics, the Tattoo 1050 milliamp 4S pack. That is like 16 to 20 dollar pack, and I could get 11 minutes. So two of those, I would be up, you know, under 40 dollars spent, and I could get 22 minutes as long as I didn't mind coming in to land in between and switch batteries. Now, if you don't want to land in between, you want to keep flying as maximum distance and as long as possible, then one of these is really going to be your best bet. Now you can cobble one together, but you run the risk of singeing your eyebrows off if something goes wrong, guys. I mean, I do appreciate those of you that are hardcore enough to cobble your own long range lie lion packs together yourself. My hat's off to you, uh, but I am not. I would rather just buy it, go out and fly it. This is a pretty decent option, you know. Um, I've never had the greatest luck with this brand as far as batteries go, but they're not bad and they don't cost as much as some of the other ones out there. So if you just want a cheap one long range pack to go cruising, if you want maximum flight time, I think there probably is no substitute for building your own. Flywoo also has another version. I'll leave the link to that one in the description below as well. What do you think in the comments, guys? Are you long ranging? And if you are, are you on this new style four inch micro long range or are you on a traditional seven inch long range like this FR7, which one is more popular? Leave me in the comments, should I address this issue and let you guys talk it out on one of the live streams coming up soon? Uh, I don't know. Thanks guys.